I've made it to the museum. Melina called you in to help her with the exhibit, right? Right. And now she's missing. Oh, that sounds bad. It's too soon to tell. What are you doing at the museum again? The museum she works for is opening an exhibit of Greek antiquities, and apparently the museum has been losing staff right and left. Eesh. Well, make sure you stand in the middle, then. You look into everything at the museum, and in the meantime, we'll contact the network. Call us if you need anything. Thanks, I will. Especially... Help! What was that? I gotta go. Hello? Help me, please! Help! Be quiet! Leave her alone! Thanos. It's rehearsal. No need for that. But we'll take the compliment. Take five, Thanos. I'm so sorry to interrupt your rehearsal. Don't be. I'm sorry I scared you like that. I thought we were alone. You were very convincing. I'm Nancy, by the way. I'm Xenia. Nice to meet you. I'm here to help Melina with the museum. Perfect. I'm pretty busy. Hopefully we'll get to know each other. What's your play about? Oh, you'll like it. It's got kidnapping, extortion, death, trickery, getting cast down into Hades with no hope of escape. The usual boy meets girl in ancient Greece story. Sounds exciting. I hope so. We're performing the story of Persephone to open the new exhibit. Persephone? Screwed up all the uh, hmm. alerts. Hold on. Refresh my memory. She's the daughter of Demeter, goddess of the harvest. But even Demeter can't keep her daughter safe. Hades kidnaps Persephone, you saw that part, and takes her to be his queen. I'm glad I'm in modern day Greece. The dating scene back then seemed pretty rough. That it was. Honestly, the material's a little difficult to work with. I feel like I know her. The more we rehearse, the more I want the story to have a happier ending. You play Persephone, I presume? I do. I'm also directing the show. That's great. I hope I get a chance to see it. I just hope it's worth seeing. We're doing our best, but can you keep a secret? I'm out of my depth here. None of the rest of them can know, but I am deep, deep in the woods. I know that feeling, but I think you can accomplish a lot by just acting like someone who knows what's happening. I have to. I put myself out there. I said, I can do this. So now I have to show up and be the boss, and I have to yell, and even though my voice sounds like shaking paper in my head and my insides feel like snapping twigs, none of them can know that. I just needed to say it. I bet you'll do just fine. Really? What makes you think so? I don't know. It just seemed like a supportive thing to say. You're nice. Hey, you seem pretty together, but can I give you some advice? Sure. Be careful around the boys, especially Thanos. Why? He's a bit intense. Goodbye. Bye. Okay. Hi, I'm Nancy. You must be... Hermes, god of charisma and handsomeness. But the mortals call me Gregor. Nice to meet you. The same. What's your role? I guess I'm playing the part of the museum assistant. Then why don't we become friends? I'm open to that. More than friends? Less open to that. Boyfriend at home? <laughs> yeah. Oh, good. That doesn't affect the average. Dude just went for it. What's your role in the production? Too many things. Is that usual? Yes, but things are a little more intense this time. Because there are so few of you? Mm-hmm. Why don't you have a larger support crew? Generally we do. But because the background checks were really extensive, we didn't have time to worry about anyone other than ourselves. To answer your question, I work the lights and the stage cues. I make sure we've got the right scripts, then I do my best to keep us from killing each other. I'll let you go. Goodbye.
Can't imagine the muse museum offices down here. Arterus and the Underworld. Following their death, Souls had to pay an obelisk coin to the ferryman Charon for a passage across the river Acheron. On the far side of the river, they arrived at the gates to the Underworld, which were guarded by the three-headed dog Cerberus. After passing through the gates, Souls wandered the Underworld until they stood before Radamanthus, Minos, and Aikos, the judges of the dead. Once the soul was judged, they could either enter the gates to Elysium if they had lived an exemplary life, or Tartarus if they needed to atone for their transgressions. Contemned souls, guided by the hundred-handed Hecaton Carries giants, labored over their punishments in Tartarus. King Sisyphus, for his trickery and lies, was made to roll a boulder uphill, only to see it come rolling back down just before reaching the top every time. Husband murdering Danaides, futilely toiled carrying water in a leaky basin. Tantalus was a man invited to dine with the gods, but he stole their nectar and ambrosia to share with other mortals. He was sentenced to spend eternity in Tartarus up to the, his neck in water. The tree's fruit blowing tantalizingly just out of reach any time he tried to reach for one. Deep within the pit of Tartarus was the prison which held the elder gods, the Titans. Led by Cronus, the Titans had ruled the earth until Cronus' son Zeus ignited a rebellion against him. With his allies, including the big long H-word, and wielding his lightning bolts, Zeus defeated and imprisoned all the Titans who had fought against him except Atlas. Zeus punished Atlas by forcing him to hold the world on his shoulders. Cool. I need to figure out the combo. Obviously. Hermes presents Persephone in Winter starring Hermes. The wings don't actually do anything, Xenia. Lights and keep. Oh, I gotta click on these. Why does Thanos keep having his lines cut? At this point, I'm carrying the show. This isn't Hermes' story. What gives? Maybe Xenia can explain. Look into autom automation of light cues. Xenia keeps adding to Hermes' role. At this point, I can barely make the cues between scenes. All light cue changes in fly system weight settings originate with Xenia, and script notes cues will be signed off by Xenia and Gregor. Paradox, Eureka, Logic, Crocodile, Ocean, Python, Tragic, Echo, Lyric, Hero, Gymnasium, Iron. Probably supposed to figure out what word or what letter from each of these words. Pretty early for uh, Albertans. It's just five o'clock right now. Stay away from that. It'll kill you. What exactly am I staying away from? That's the fly system. It controls the scenery and the curtains, and it'll kill you. I'll be careful then. Probably have to play with this later. This is her stage? It's pretty sick stage. Hi. What can you tell me about Gregor? I like him. I know he's the type to flatter. I know it's self-serving to listen to him when he tells me I'm gorgeous and brilliant. But you know what? I can use the emotional junk food some days. What made you interested in ancient Greece? Hmm. I guess if I had to pick an answer, I'd say the ancient Greeks. Okay, fair answer. It seems a little strange that there are only four people in the entire cast and crew. A good stage director doesn't cast herself, but I understand Persephone. Okay, how? I was this happy girl, and one day I fell into this vast sadness. I got out of it. But just like Persephone, I know it will come back for me, even on my best days. I definitely see you have a personal connection with Persephone, but what happens if there's a problem during the performance and you're all on stage? I don't like to think about that. Bye-bye.
Talk to you later. Locked. But apparently the mailbox isn't. I heard something break. What's going on? I was freehand tracing. Okay. I wanted to understand the detail work, so I put thin paper on the glass, leaned in close, and... Put too much weight on the glass? Please don't tell anyone I broke the case. Sounds like it was an honest mistake. I'm sure you have nothing to worry about. I don't know you. Do you know me? Not yet. I'm Nancy. Niobe. I'm the reason we can't have nice things, on a cultural level. You're in the play, right? I'm Demeter. You seem focused. Am I interrupting? Yes. Thank you, though. I need the break. Aren't you excited for opening night? No. No and no. Nope. Are you nervous? Nervous when I sleep. Terrified when I'm awake. I'm so relieved we've only got the one show. Just one? That's nothing. <sighs> you should leave. What? Why? You might end up spoiling the ending if you hear too much. I think I know how it ends. No. Our ending is different. More frightening. Less predictable. Are you... Late? Yes. I have to go. Yep. Temple one, temple two, three. This pots, pots and pan. Gonna have to classify those, aren't I? Ancient Greek coins. Greeks began using coins initially one sided lumps of gold or silver around 650 BC. As coining techniques improved, coins evolved into circular stamp pieces with images on either side. Greece's independently run polis or city states issued their own currencies. These coins were typically stamped with the image of a ruler on one side and a civic symbol representing their polis on the other. Modern coins around the world continue to use this design style. Uh, ancient Greek jewelry. Jewelry was a status symbol in ancient Greece, typically only worn by the upper class. With the high level of craftsmanship behind each piece, jewelry became family heirlooms passed down through generations. Gold was the most popular metal to work with, as it was easy, easily malleable and tarnished little over time. Popular gemstones to work into pieces included amethyst, garnets, emeralds, and pearls. Old leaf crowns were generally only used in religious rites due to the fragile nature of the thin gold leaf. Nancy, welcome to Greece. Come find me in my office and I'll give you the drachma tour. If I'm not in, show yourself around and introduce yourself to the theater troupe. While we're working to get the show up, they'll be getting ready for a show of their own. We'll be taking care of relations between the troupe and the museum, but it never hurts to make some new friends. This exhibit will go down in history as one of the finest explorations of Greek culture. I couldn't think of anyone better to help me make it happen. 
Since we don't have a doormat, you'll find your key to the office with Nike. For today, make sure the vase display is properly labeled. Create the temple images for the architecture display. Get tickets assigned for tonight's performance. That should do it for now. Good luck and try not to set off any alarms. In Molina. Do you know don't know? Now, there's been a change in plans. I'm doing my best to track down the missing pieces as quickly as possible. Hopefully, what we're looking at is a simple shipping error. I've already contacted the local authorities to open an investigation. All staff and members of the troop consented to searches and interviews. The theater troop may come to you with access requests, and members of the troop have been put through the same screening process you and I have, so they are more than welcome to any resources they need. On the off chance you don't see anything out of the ordinary, give me a call. Still, I can rule out a shipping error. We're not pointing fingers in any direction, but still keep an eye out for any red flags. I'll do my best to return quickly, but until I do, it's up to you to keep the wheels from falling off the wagon and get the exhibit ready for opening night. It makes use of my office to catch up on any information related to our exhibits and processes. Phase display, temple images, get tickets assigned. So we go get our stuff from Nike first. The Greek statues from antiquity are known for their classical natural marble look, but when the sculptures were originally displayed over 2,000 years ago, they were anything but white. Carved marble of all kinds, including sculptures and temples, was painted in bright shades and patterns. Though the colors have now faded or visibly disappeared, researchers are sometimes able to determine the original paint colors and designs using ultraviolet lights, infrared, and x-ray spectroscopy, spectroscopy tests. Reproductions here offer a glimpse of the vivid world of ancient Greece. Honestly, it looks better without the color. I'm so sorry I wasn't able to meet you in person. Oh, that's okay. Is something wrong? Yes, something is very wrong. Some of our exhibit pieces have gone missing. Are they lost or...? Stolen. I don't know. And frankly, it doesn't matter. The pieces in question, they're worth millions. If I can't recover them, our doors are as good as closed. I'm here for you. Anything you need. Oh, thank you. A lifetime of thank yous. I still need you to do the job we brought you on for, and you'll find everything you need for that in the office. But more importantly, I need you to be my eyes and ears. Does that mean you think we're dealing with theft? I really hope not, but we can't rule that out. But you're worried. I am. Okay, why is that? The pieces we lost never arrived. They were on the shipping invoice, but they were not in the crate. Is that common? It could be a simple mistake. Or it could be someone changed the invoice to buy enough time to smuggle the jewelry out. I'm tracking down both possibilities. That's why I need you here. You got it. I'm following the paper trail now. And with luck, I'll find the error and be back tomorrow. You worry about that. I'll take care of the museum. Great. You'll find everything you need in the office. Do you suspect that anyone in the cast took the missing jewelry? We did at first. But then? The police came in, interviewed everyone, and the cast was very cooperative. That's good, at least. Maybe. Maybe? They all consented to having their cars and hotels searched. The police reviewed all of the security footage and came to the conclusion that no one in the cast snuck anything out of the museum. But you doubt this. For all intents and purposes, they're cleared. But it just doesn't make sense. Nothing just disappears. I should tell you, Niobe broke one of the necklace display cases. What? She said she was trying to trace the detail work and put too much pressure on the glass. Is everything still there? I think so. Well, thanks Zeus for that. How did she react when you talked to her about it? She was really upset. She actually asked me not to tell you. Like no one would notice. <sighs> These things do happen. Keep an eye on her. Mistakes happen. But a series of mistakes 
Don't. Got it. Bye-bye. Goodbye. What do we got here? Animals. Oh my god. You have a Nancy Drew Kringle phone case? There's a level of nerdness I'm willing to accept. That's too far. That's too far. So much reading, man. I think that's all the reading. I don't, I got nothing out of that. Okay, and this might be important. Like maybe? I don't even know. The password must be around here somewhere. Not in the picture.
like the invoice looks like it's tampered with. All right, what could would what could the password be? It's not gonna be Persephone, is it? Am I supposed to match this to that in clipboard? I legit don't have a guess for this password. There's something I haven't clicked on yet. I already typed in Greece. Just like a girl, I assume it's a fan? I can plug in my phone. Interesting.
still have to do that. Check. I literally have no idea. No, I have a book of underworld myths. Just Tartarus in the underworld. Finally! What happened back there? Sorry, I was caught off guard from a very convincing scene from a play. So, everything is fine? Can't say that for sure, but no one is being actively kidnapped. Nancy, I've got a strange feeling about what's happening at the museum. I feel the same way. Something seems a bit off. Want us to look into everyone at the museum? That would be great. Please do. Consider it done. Call us back in a bit, and we'll have everything you need to know. I might need some outside help. Do you know anything about Greek art? You're in luck. I am. We'll make a call and have the book sent to you right away. Thanks. What's the network? ATAC. Why change the name? Apparently, the FBI doesn't like explaining that they get help from America's teens. Ah, okay. I don't see a, you must be this old to solve a crime sign anywhere. Well, there might be a law about that somewhere. Don't care. What am I going to do with all my ATAC shirts? I have so many! Sorry to bring up a sore point. ATAC forever! But really, it's the network now. What have you guys been up to? The usual. Adventures, globetrotting, business school, on the side. Are you thinking of leaving the mystery game behind? No, I'm working on a project. You are going to freak when you find out. Cho! I'm not supposed to talk about it. Interesting. It's no big deal, really, but I don't want to jinx it. Okay, I have to say one thing. Zero things is a better option. You're going to love it. It involves me? I can't say. It's way down the road, but for now, I'll just wait until Joe accidentally tells everyone. Me too. I'll let you go. Not helpful at all. Bye. Tell me the password to the computer. Goodbye. You couldn't just ask Goodbye. her? She actually answered the phone. That's from the last one we just did. This is from the Scotland one. I don't think we've done this one. What the hell is your password, lady? You got a bell with an arch. Is it like the freaking... What's that back there? Pantheon? Tried Parthenon. Is 
did Par Parthenon right after. Mykonos? Oh my goodness. I don't think it's supposed to be this hard to start the game. When I looked at the computer the first time, it said, she must have the password around here somewhere. You can't click on the post-its or this thing. We can put our phone in the dock, but it doesn't do anything. Drawers, nothing. I have a favor. Can you help me get a closer look at some of the locked up pieces? Okay, I'll ask. Thanks. Do you know much about Greek mythology? Here, take this, you'll love the myths. They're full of the most amazing insanity. I'm glad we don't live in that world, for the most part. Okay, a book on the gods, cool. Later. Until later. Maybe it's this? this? This place is named after Phidias. Maybe it's one of the words in this paragraph. Can you do me a favor? Sure. What do you need? Naomi wants to make a high-resolution image of the items in the coin display. What for? She has this montage plan for when Demeter is bargaining with Hermes. She'll offer him money, jewels, none of which will work, obviously, but we wanted to project the image. Okay, how can I help? See if your boss will let us get a closer look. Obviously, we'll follow protocol to the letter. It seems like a lot of work went into production. Why only one show? One show? Who said that? Niobe. Poor Niobe. I bet she wishes it was just one. She's so scared 
All she sees is opening night. We're here the whole week. Goodbye. Talk to you later. This dude's gone somewhere. That's fine. Whatever. Let's go back and see if we can solve this shit. Olympia? Frick, man. Hi. Can I get a key to the coin display? You'll need to open the filing cabinet first. The key to the filing cabinet is hidden inside the box with the animal figurines. Pair up the animals with the images so the animal and image pair represent the same god. You got it. I know you weren't brought here for this, but I need you to learn about provenance. As in verifying the authenticity of the art? You're as sharp as they say. That's it. Isn't that normally left to the experts? Generally, yes, but if we're dealing with theft of any kind, I need you to become an expert. Instantly? Unfortunately, but you'll come to it naturally. I'm flattered, but what makes you say that? You will find that it's like solving a mystery. Which I hear you're pretty good at at home. I'll do my best. Proving provenance is a classic whodunit. You look at a vase or a painting and you follow the clues to see who... done it. Who painted or sculpted or chiseled the work in question. When you put it that way, I think I'm comfortable with the methodology. Perfect. You'll find what you need on the computer. I'm your frickin' password. I may be able to help you. Ask her the password. Goodbye. Goodbye. Doesn't need to be a mystery, you idiot. How was the flight? Couldn't tell you. I slept right through. Slept on a flight? What witchcraft is this? She's a witch! Burn her! Hi, Joe. I do not consort with witches. Our in-flight movie was about Salem, and apparently Joe took away the wrong lesson. How have I lived this long without knowing how fun reckless accusations are? Anyway, how's Greece? Well, I'm having a bit of a problem. Hmm, perhaps you should try stepping into water and letting me know if you float. I'll add that to the list. Have you been able to look into the entire cast? Yeah, you're dealing with something really serious here. Tell me more. That's the thing. We're not sure. First red flag is the staff. As in, where is everyone? We reached out to the network to see if we could track down any of the workers who left. No one would talk? No one could be found. Oh. Keep quiet on that until we figure out what's happening. We can fill you in on everyone at the museum, but these are dangerous people. You have to tread lightly. Tread lightly? She's so bad at that. Thanks, Joe. Sorry. Just be careful. Something big is happening. What did you find out about Gregor? Did you notice anything about his Greek accent? What Greek accent? Right? He's an American, and Gregor is not his name. Really? Really. So, who is he? He may be an actor, like he says. We can't figure out why he changed his name. But we did find out a bit about his past. What's his story? Pretty sad, actually. He's an only child. His parents died when he was really young. He grew up completely alone. In and out of foster care until he aged out of the system. It may explain the assumed name. Right. Maybe the name has some meaning. Right. It could be a stage name. Like a nom de plume, but for actors. Or it could be something more serious. Like a nom de guerre. 
Unlikely. Either way, we'll look into it. Did you find anything out about Xenia? She seems to be more or less who she says she is. We know she's from New York. She grew up around a lot of artists and professors and the like. Looks like she was put in contact with the production's organizers and jumped at the chance to direct. That seems reasonable. It does, but we're gonna keep looking. The dots connect, but who knows if we're seeing all the dots? Oh, I know that feeling. What can you tell me about Niobe? She is an amazing artist. Yeah? Well, she was. I saw a few of her pieces at the Met. Stunning. Her painting spoke to my soul. I didn't know you were a fan of painting. Nance, I'm more cultured than Greek yogurt. He's been saving that one. I have. I was toying with Euro puns for a while, but I couldn't figure out if it was Euro or Hero or Gyro. So I moved to Tzatziki for a while, and that was a dead end. Now, Saganaki... Reeled in, buddy. Right. Her work is abstract, but not. How so? The docent told me that under each abstract painting is a photorealistic painting. Huh? She paints over her work. She replaces the painting with the feeling of the painting. The amazing thing is that you can sense it. You know what's there. If Niobe's such a talented artist, why is she acting? The part Joe left off is likely the reason. Her career is steeped in controversy. In what way? She was accused of art forgery, but it's not true. You don't want it to be true. Of course I don't. But the docent I met said what happened to her was a tragedy. I mean, he looked like he was going to cry just by thinking about it. What happened? He wouldn't say. All he said is her paintings will never bear her name. Apparently, everyone knows she's lost all credibility in the art world, but no one seems to know why. I'll watch her from a distance for now. Do you think Melina could be involved with the missing artwork? An inside job. Wouldn't be the first time. You should talk to her, see what she says. That's always so hard to do, but comes with the territory, I guess. It's all in the tone of voice. Is that so? Yeah, check this out. Are you the type of terrible person who steals? And this works? Not at all. Just be direct. And if she gets upset, just say... Yes? Take it away, Frank. That's what I say, at least. Later. Bye. Well, we have at least one puzzle we can do. I need to match the animals to the correct symbol. One's the eagle, it's gotta be this, right? Ow. Probably not the heart, but I'm not sure what else it was in there. Oh, the peacock? Is that what this is? Dolphin for Apollo. The liar. So we already got that. Vulture. Ultra Sword.
Bow and arrow stag. That's already good. Owl olive branch. These must be the tags for the display. All right, people's time cards. We get to do some, uh, Flarotarian. Okay, that's got to be it, right? We in, baby! I need to assign seats according to everyone's requests. Backrose doesn't want any prime seats, so he doesn't want blue. Gavril and Lilies are the only VIP ticket holders. Macros' seat numbers are higher than Adamu's, but lower than Manos's. Demo's group fills all but one prime seat. Lilis wants only front row seats. Gavril wants three of his six tickets to be adjoining standard seats. The fuck, man? You're allowed to use the handicap spots. Gavril's got six seats. It's also VIP. Macros needs three seats. Lilith needs five. Who the frick is Manos? Are we supposed to fill this whole thing out?
Damo's group fills all but one prime seat. Macros' seat numbers are higher than Adamo's, but lower than Manos's. Manos is somewhere. Lilith is VIP and wants only front row tickets and has three, five tickets. Lilith has the ability to sit in VIP. It doesn't say they need to be VIP. I feel like we're missing information.
Looks like I'll need a unique password to access the archives. Want to know a secret? Are the seats packed with the dead? Should I line you up and punch you down into the land of the dead? Well, do you want to know a secret? So polite. Oh, I mustn't talk in the theater. Curses for all the gods. I've gone and broken the fourth wall. But no bother. Your beloved real world is itself theater. You're used to pretend, used to believing what you want to believe. What the fuck? For the next 90 minutes, I will be telling you lies. And you will agree they are the truth. That's actually more or less what's printed on my business card. Hermes, messenger to the gods. Certified liar, founder and CEO of Olympic Scandal Magazine, inventor of gossip. I'll be handing these out after the show. Mercury keeps poaching my clients these days. Roman gods, pfft, cheap knockoffs. Bacchus is a cool guy. The rest, forgeries of our greatness. Except no substitutions. Yeah, I'm not going through that. Didn't see anything else. Fuck. Leaf necklace. Let's do the provenance thing. I hate the ticketing puzzle.
Done. Received. Second of July by Stavros. Current owner on loan from exhibit loan ends. Golden Age exhibit. State Museum of Fine Arts through September. All done. With an Amean lion? Done. The mean lion came from Lion Sculpture. World of Gods and Heroes, June twenty ninth, Mikhail. Gotta be this Costa Bezos Gallery through November. Don't remember when it was received. Ninth of June, Mikhail. Done. Vase depicting four women, one seated holding a bird, another standing directly behind her chair.
Done. Wait, if those time cards are correct, then the signature for the vase can't be right. Permanent collection red figure vase for women, Sophia, 30th of June. He was on holiday. Oh shit, son. Who was here on who was here on the 30th of June? Davros was. And so was Chloe, but she quit right after the 30th of June. Suspect, Chloe. Okay, permanent collection. This has got to be the one vase, Natural Archaeological Museum of Athens, blown through August. So do I submit it like this though? Because it can't be of, it can't have been Sophia. It could have only been Stavros or Chloe. Got it. Unable to confirm provenance. Okay, that's fine. Sounds like I got it right. Check. Did that. Can't check that off yet. Haven't done that. Sorry, can't talk now. Thing. I need something to help me figure out which face is which first. Yeah, yeah. Got rid of the keys. The key. Now I can just open these whenever I want. What do we got? We got the logic puzzle. We got um, Niobe not really wanting to have a chat. I remember in the Iceland one, we had a really annoying logic puzzle as well. The problem with these is knowing where to start, right?
Damu's group fills all but one prime seat. Like that to me seems easy because it also says that each seat in a Damu's group is adjacent to another member of their party. Avril, who has access to VIP, wants three of his seats adjoining standard seats, or the yellows. So to me, that means they gotta be these ones. Like, or could one of them could be this one, and then these two. Eat this.
So I I did have Gavril here. And these three are definitely adjoined. Like I don't know if this one does. Yeah, I agree. There's not enough information. Yeah, there's not there's no more information. Go talk with people, I guess. I need a big favor. Okay, what's that? Can you set me up with the time cards from the office? I have been so underwater, I haven't been tracking our rehearsal time. I'll see what I can do. Why did you choose Persephone's story? I didn't click with it at first, but now when we rehearse, when I'm in the meadow, waiting for Hades, in my mind, I don't see the Narcissus flowers I'm gathering. I see the moments of my life when everything turns sour. But I see myself, the Persephone version of myself, and I am her. I know that's weird. That means there's something real about it. Niobe can study the coins now, if she wants. If? She'll die when she finds out. She seems to care more about the art than acting. That's it on the nose. Makes rehearsals a nightmare, but I never turn down a chance to work with a true genius. That's how you describe her? Not on the stage. Not yet, at least. Maybe not ever. But I've seen her creeping through the museum when she thinks she's alone. She says she's taking a private class taught by the greats. Did you know about Niobe's career problems? That she copied another artist's work? Well, something like that. Stop the questions there. I've never met anyone more regretful than Niobe. Goodbye. Talk to you later. Guaranteed we're supposed to get one letter out of each of these. Definitely need to figure out what to do here before I try anything.
hi. Bye-bye. Talk to you later. Thank you for unlocking the display for me. Why are you so interested in them? The tooling marks tell a story about how they're made. For the most part, we still don't understand the full method. Bits and pieces, but that's it. I'd love to see if I can see something, anything to add to that discussion. Are you Niobe, the famous painter? Was. A friend of mine is obsessed with your work. I don't want to hear about your friend or anyone else. I'm sorry. Did I upset you? You did! It's not your fault, but I had to snap at you. Uh, why? No one cared about my art, but they love to look at the smoking wreckage of my career. I don't talk about that. Okay, I respect that. I'm starting over. I'm here. This is what I've got now. Is the museum's collection the real reason you're here? What makes you ask that? I'm supposed to be trying new things in my life. That's what everyone says. Move on. Be new. Try new things. Don't dwell. Sorry if I offended. It just seems like a pretty rare chance to study all of this great work. Oh, guilty. I heard different words from what you meant. I can't even begin to tell you what it's like. When I was small, and the other girls were crushing on the boys, I was falling in love with Phidias. No joke. A terminal art girl from the jump. Which reminds me, in case it's contagious, I've got books for you. Learn the language and art will speak to you. If I wasn't so terrified of that nightmarish amphitheater, I'd be skipping around the place. What's your art background? I completed my first piece, Oatmeal on Vertical Plaster Wall, at six months. It was magnificent. From there, it was variations on a similar theme. So you came to it naturally? I came to loving it naturally. The rest was a struggle. But I always loved the study, especially the old Greek masters. Look around the museum. You're in the presence of greatness. Art is the physical manifestation of men and women reaching across thousands of years to share their secrets. And secrets never come easy, but they also never leave your heart. They're reaching out for you, Nancy. See them and reach back. Could an artist create an exact copy of the art on display? Who are you trying to fool? An expert, I guess. Which expert? Any expert. That's the trick. That's why most forgery doesn't work. Each expert speaks a different language. Some are chemists. Some focus on the process until they dream in brush strokes, patina, and lacquers. It's easy to fool one expert. Impossible to fool every expert. Could you? I couldn't fool any expert, let alone every expert. Do you have access to much of the museum's art? I get to study what's out and already catalogued, but I can't get at the rest. Later. Goodbye. I was hoping you were going to give me a book on vases so I could do the vase thing at least. Right, we don't have the password for that. Can't even change it. We did that right.
The the last thing I think the current puzzle we have is the stupid ass picketing. It also suggests that I need to. All oh, right, she asked for the time cards. I should call Melina before giving these to Xenia. Hi. Xenia wants a copy of the time cards. Can I share those with her? No. Should I be concerned that she wants the time cards? Maybe. Okay, I'll stall for now. Any advice? Keep an eye on her. Talk to you later. Thanks for nothing, voice Goodbye. on the phone. Hello. Later. Bye. I haven't seen a gift shop, honey. That's what you mean by uh, like a book for the vases. Now, as I was saying, do you want to hear a secret? Yes. I'm also the guide to the underworld. Hades, the old Greek soul closet. Little known fact about being dead. Death is very boring. Not much happens in Hades. It's just a lot of souls being dead in chairs, being dead at breakfast, dead souls just wandering about. That's the gist of it. I mean, every four years, we have our own Olympics, but we've yet to fully figure out soul physics. Archimedes is doing his best, but we're still no closer to finding the pole vaulters. They just went, uh, you know, just gone. Quite floaty and dearly missed, like spice ships at sea. So you must understand my interest was piqued when I discovered the underworld exploding with news, curiosity, intrigue. A mysterious young woman was coming so beautiful, so sad, so frightened. Yet those were not the qualities that drew the land of the dead to watch her every move. No, what moved them so was that this girl was alive. I have a tragic tale to tell a story of three gods who conspired and fought over the fate of one lost girl it's a story i've told before sometimes the maiden persephone returns home escapes from hades unscathed and sometimes the dark forces of the underworld prevail zeus how does the story end you just want me to skip everybody else's lines okay I was gonna say, I just. It's on nine? I only have. I was gonna say, I don't know. The next one. Or the next speech? Oh, okay, let me find the next speech here. Which is in here somewhere. Hermes, there's a little speech. Oh, there it is. How are you not cold? It's it's cold, very chilly, pretty nippy. It's, it's pretty nippy indeed, my friend. The big Z is not feeling chatty, I see. Could that be because I convinced you to marry off Demeter's daughter and now she's destroying life as we know it? Eh, probably it. I hate it when you're angry. Makes swans even more untrustworthy than they already are. Some people say that death has a twisted sense of humor. I assure you, Death has no sense of humor. Speak of the Greek analog of the devil, and the Greek analog of the devil appears. Shut it. Speak of the Greek analog of the devil, and the Greek analog of the devil appears. Shut it. I would love to shut it, but I need clarification on which it I must shut to make you happy. Shut your mouth, or I'll shut you in an airless cell under the river's fire. There it is. Zeus! I'm afraid this one's on me, darling. The big guy is peeved. Have you noticed that you've been getting a bit more boat traffic these days? The harvest is always strong. 
you're about to run into some economies of scale issues. Speak plainly. Demeter has frozen the world. You're about to be swimming in corpses. I am prepared. We're not. Not so much. I have taken my queen, the queen you gave to me. Whoa, whoa. Introduced, not gave. I guess it depends on the culture and the era. And if one party is a nymph, and the other party... and the other party the second most powerful god... And if one party is a nymph, and the other party the second most powerful god... Eh, I guess it depends on the culture and the era. I've always said that. I said that just earlier. You are great, but you're giving back your queen one way or another. Listen, let's calm tensions. The god economy has not been great. We're not in the shape to have a god war here. Let's be civil. Civility is weakness in practice. Practice makes perfect. Sort it out with Demeter. Persephone is my queen, and so she will remain. I suppose I'm left to deal with... I suppose I'm left to deal with this, but I also suppose this is more or less my fault. I'm having a me day. You have my sympathy. And you have mine, Hermes. I just drove a train through that pause. People, come I was on. Trying to cry. Yeah, it... I just drove a train through there. Okay, ah! okay. I mean, you know, I'm not gonna just throw. I'm not gonna like throw it on her. Way too much silence. Okay, pick I it up a little bit. Okay, okay, pick it up a little bit. Start over, like, Hermes. You get to say it again. Up. It's not exactly my place. Demeter, you have my sympathy. And you have mine, Hermes. She was here when he took her. Do you want to know how I know? Of course, my dear. The grass dies under my feet. Do you see the color drain from the hills? Can you hear the cracking of the leaves? The crunch of dead bones? The drum-tight skin of soil gone cold? We all do. As do I. This is not my will. Persephone is safe. This I promise. The fruits and grasses, do you know how they came to be? They come in dreams. Speak up a little bit more, Niobe. I dream of being new and small, warm in the soil. A little bit more. Wet by the rain. Wet with rain. Slowly waking as the warm face of Helios fills my soul with restless joy. I begin to listen moment by moment. I begin... This is really long. It's a monologue. It's, it's excessive. No, this no, I don't stupid. think so. Why is it stupid? Because if she's truly in brief, she wouldn't, f she wouldn't ramble on. Oh yes, this is this is stupid. Why, uh, if she's if Demeter is really sad, why would she continue on and on and on, especially to someone who hurt her so much? This is not quite reality. It's a play. We're using words to describe how we. feel. Feel. Most actors would love this. I mean, I oh. love this. Okay, okay. <laughs> I feel the wishes above the grass. The hare wishes for clover. Perhaps I will grow to be clover. The man wishes for an olive. You you missed an N. It's for for an olive tree to grow near his home. Oh, if I could be an olive tree, I would. And when I wake and step into the day, my dreams take root. How do you feel about that? How do you feel about your dreams taking root? I think you're rather ripping them up now, aren't you? I feel like I, if I was in mourning, I would keep my mouth shut. I don't know you would know what mourning is like. Okay, we're, uh, no, no, completely Stand off topic. Let's just focus. Sorry. When Persephone focus. was growing inside me, that might be a Jesus. bit much yeah. for the art crowd. A bit much for the art crowd. Did you hear? Yeah, bit I much know. for the art crowd. <laughs> <laughs> Just, yeah. just go with it. It's fine. It's fine. What would you know about art? She joined me in my dreams. We grew together in the soil each night. In those dreams, I taught her how all things grow. Seed by seed, we grow strong into the sky together. And when I woke, she continued to dream? She continued to dream. It's a statement. She continued to dream. Like, <laughs> oh, like reality TV. The night before she was born, she appeared as the girl I had yet to meet. Can, we, can I say my you can, you can do whatever you want to do. The night before she was born, she appeared as the girl I had yet to meet. 
and she took me by the hand. She led me toward a tr towards. You missed an S. She led me towards a tree I had never seen before. It was small and wild. A spray green dotted with red bulbs. With red bulbs? You're really excited about that. A spray, a spray green dotted with red bulbs. That's a little bit better. Yeah, yeah, that's good. No matter how you direct it, the writing is just silly. Stop criticizing the script. We have a bigger job here to do. Well, then save cut the, the script in half and get save on the with lines. the rest of the job. She plucked a strange, she plucked a strange new fruit for me. It was her creation. It was her gift to me. She is a very special young woman. That sounds really creepy. I understand how you must Okay, okay. Up. You do not understand. What we have some I other things to do, and you won't cut the script, so I'm just going to keep going, okay? Niobe, that's enough. I mean, we are wasting precious time here. I was not brought here to act, as I clearly can't. In the interest of time, can I keep going with your precious script now again she's in my dreams only now she's slipping into death we're not quiet seeds waiting in bloom we're prisoners clawing through stone every night i dream of digging down tearing the very earth apart with my hands until the bones break loose the skin drops away and i've bled all the blood left in me and at last when i break through i reach down for her i feel her fingers her reaching out as desperately as me and i pull with every bit of strength i have and when i wake and when i step out into the day i see that i have only pulled more death into the world that's how i'm going to do it in the performance you're gonna run out of air that is how i'm going to do it you do not have any control over me when i am actually on stage this is crazy but also, it sounds like from these recordings that they're all in on like some sort of heist, like they're all doing a heist. Okay. All right. Let's just. Continue. I don't know how to make the dream stop. You have to let her go. These flowers don't die. All else dies, but not these flowers. That is how I know she was taken from me here. Until she returns, all life will frost and crumble. Torn down to dry bone and rock. The wind will spit dust, but these flowers will never die. Think of Persephone. Is this what she would want? You have no right to speak of what she would want. Can we get a little less space, Captain? A little more delivery god? Please think of all the living things. Why do we keep going back to this? I'm not going you back are. to anything. Yes, you yes. keep rewriting it. He's creepy, right? Do you agree? He's kind of creepy. You we were supposed what? to do there a character conference. I was set to do it. We never did it, and now I'm trying to feel the same. What if she is with me? But right. when she wakes, she finds she has pulled more life into the underworld. If that is so, let all living things die, so she will never be alone. Never feel far away from love. And when it is done, when it is all done, maybe then I will be allowed to cross the burning river. Zeus will never allow you to carry out this plan. He has no control over me. He can be persuasive. How can he stop me if I can't stop myself? What? What was that, Niobe? I think that's the first real bit of acting I have seen all day. That was beautiful. Oh my gosh. Just keep going. Keep going. We will be that. reunited in life or in death. It makes no matter to me. Okay, maybe I take that back. Can you just... A little bit more energy. You just said it was good acting. Now you're saying it's no, not. You, uh, you don't understand the difference. Just, just, okay. We're going back to more energy. We will be reunited in life or in death. It makes no matter to me. Can you feel the chill? The white winds of... What? There are no winds in Olympus. How do you know that? Because I studied Greek art, you nincompoop. How can you draw wind anyway? Olympus, Olympuses, Olympus peaks. That is a very strange string of words. The white winds of Olympus peaks are descending into the valleys below. The rivers glaze with mud and ice. Hades has stolen my life. I will steal his death. Okay, we've got through all that. I tried these using. Hi, Nancy. 
I'll let you go. Goodbye. Gotta be the stupid ticket thing, man. That's all we got left. That or tell her that she can't have the time cards, I guess. Hello. Later. Until later. All right. Can I help with anything? We're set. I can't keep distracting you from your job anyway. Later. Bye. We're not even going to talk about it. Okay, cool. Yet. Jesus Christ, I'm not reading 30 pages. Is there any, like, notes?
Well, I didn't know I needed to do that, but let's snoop. I should assemble the image. Is that so? Well, these two go together, so that doesn't go there. Not quite, though. As soon as they go in the right spot, you can't move them. Okay, that's good to know. Found ya. to go together. Probably like that. Uh, wherever this goes. He's good again. Clearly not there. Keep giving me the top one.
So these these two seem to go together as well. Okay, I got that in the right spot, but it doesn't go with these things. I had a feeling that one went there. Do not know where you go yet. Still. Alright, we got a pillar going. Apparently that goes there. somewhere I need to figure out where you go dude Mine found it. You probably don't have a pillar in the back of your head. Floating head, cool. I doubt Nancy's got the official. Dick filled fresco. This is the picture from the vase.
God damn. Wait. The National Archaeological Museum of Athens. Sounds very official. Eritrea painter. 425 BCE. Oh my god, you gotta do like a hundred of these? Crushing it.
the back of your head look like you? Start spamming. Done. Heracles and Athena. Oh my god. Yeah, this is gonna be the last one. I think I'm gonna stop. At least we can start next time with this.
it's a boat.
all done. All right, I think we're gonna call this one here. Uh, we will pick this up next week from the mosaics and the stupid ticketing system.